this year's tag match started just like the ones before it. And as always, it's all about competition. As I was talking with the guys from the 690th MP company, it became apparent that when the match began, they didn't know every member of their team. One guy, Castro, I, I don't know his first name, he joined us, he's from a different company, and he just fit it right in. He's tearing up the uh, targets real well, so, you know, we're, we're happy he's here. So as they start working as a team, they also start to become friends. Kind of, you just click right away, you know, you got something, a job to do, and... You just get to know each other going through it. And it's not just the four guys who are shooting who are getting closer. So you're going to do six rounds, left or right. We've got uh, Captain Negley. Um, he's with the battalion. He's giving us a lot of pointers hanging out. So we got a captain, a couple uh, staff sergeants, and a few specialists. And we're all just, you know, hanging out. Making friends in a competition like this has another benefit to the Florida National Guard. When a mission comes up down the road, they won't have to worry about breaking the ice because... In a few months, if I see Castro again, boom, we're already friends. You know, it's, it's, it's a cool thing. And finally, if you'd like to compete in next year's tag match with some friends or possibly make some new ones... Pass your PT test. <laughs> that simple? Pass your PT test? Well, I mean, it comes with all the other fundamentals that comes with shooting, but you got to meet the requirements, the basic requirements, to be able to even be put on orders for this. And they told me although the competition only lasts for two days, they hope the friendships they make here will last a lifetime. Reporting from Camp Landing, I'm A.J. Artley for the Florida National Guard. Always ready, always there.